So when's the last time you wore shoes at work? They can make a big difference to the rest of your body. Posture expert Dr. Eliza is back and she's going to tell us why. Good morning to you. Nice to see you again. Good morning. Nice to see you as well. So, so many people working from home are probably sitting around in sock feet right now, right? And it is, is or they're wearing, they're wearing slippers like me. <laughs> yes, yes. And, and I, I know you have your own line of slippers, so we'll get to that. But I mean, is it okay to, because uh, lots of people say, oh, go, going barefoot is best, but other people need shoe support. So the thing is, most people actually really do need a supportive shoe that's cushioned. And the reason why is when you talk about going barefoot, it's better when you're on a surface that has natural shock absorption. So we're talking about grass, sand, soil. But most people, when they're at home, what's underneath their feet is actually concrete. So whether you have wood, laminate, vinyl, underneath that is concrete. And that's why you need something that can give you that shock absorption. And because we spend so much time sitting, it actually causes our hip flexors to tighten up. So most people end up rolling in, and we call that overpronation. Because most people end up rolling in, they also need arch support to help that. And that will help prevent things like foot pain, knee pain, and lower back pain. So you know, for the majority of people, I would say over 90%, barefoot at home is not best. And you definitely cannot go barefoot in the office. So right. if you join barefoot, <laughs> it's going to be a very hard transition for you. Yes, yes. So let's talk about the slippers that you're wearing then, because you have a line of slippers now. Absolutely. So I have a line of shoes, and I actually designed slippers during the pandemic because I was spending so much time at home and noticed that my knees started to flare up, my feet started to flare up, and it's because I wasn't in my supportive shoe. So I designed slippers that have a great orthotic insole so that you have that great support, and then also you have the shock absorption with EVA. So it's like you're wearing running shoes, but you're cozy and supported while you're at home. And you know what? I've had some customers who have even brought their slippers into the office, so they have a pair of office slippers because they look kind of chic, so you can actually wear them out. So they have a pair of office slippers and a pair of home slippers as well. Okay, very cool. And you also, I understand, have a line of socks now. How can socks make a difference? So socks are great because most people also, if you're sitting too much, you need a little bit of compression to boost circulation. If you are sitting all the time, blood tends to pool, and then that can lead to swelling in the feet, it can lead to foot pain, it can lead to swollen ankles, which a lot of people notice. So if you're wearing some socks that have some compression and arch support, then you can keep that circulation stimulated and your feet will feel better, you'll feel more energized, and you're not going to get all that blood pooling. You've made and compression also, socks look very cool then. <laughs> exactly, so they're a little bit different from your old school compression socks. They're like sport compression socks that you can wear for athletic activities or just to wear at home as well. Okay, now let's talk about your shoes because you design fabulous looking shoes and fabulous feeling shoes. Yes, and that is so important because if you've been used to being at home in your slippers, when you go back into the office, you really do want to keep that comfort at home, but not a slipper or sneakers are not appropriate for everyone. So this shoe here is actually the Dr. Liza sneaker. And it is a sneaker that doesn't look like a sneaker. So this is a great shoe that you can wear to the office. It looks business casual, but it feels exactly like a sneaker. It has the same shock absorption. It has the same orthotic insole. And you know, when I wear these, I feel like I'm bouncing and just ready to run. Like, this is what I wear for walking. This is what I wear for traveling. And the great part is, it doesn't look like a sneaker. So this is great to wear to work, and it can be worn by women and by men. So this is a great genderless shoe that you can wear to work, you can wear at home, you can wear for your walks. Awesome. Now we've run out of time, but where can people get your line? Oh, so you can find Dr. Liza Shoes at drlizashoes.com. And there's also a little promo online today if you want to go pick a couple pairs up and wear them for work, wear 
them at home or wear them for walk because it's always great to get outside. Okay, Dr. Liza, always great chatting with you. I, I look forward to seeing you in person again with your shoes. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I would so love to be back at the studio. Okay, we'll have the link up at chch.com. Thank you. Thank you.